I've always been a big fan of David Beckham. I think it's his passion on the game. I've got David Beckham's phone number. Would you like me to give him a ring? Amazing. I don't think he'd answer, but yeah. Hello. Hello. Is that David? Hi, Peter. How are you? Right, just a moment. Just really, um, hello? Hi, Mo. It's David Beckham. How are you? How am I supposed to believe this is David Beckham, guys? I promise you this is David Beckham. I've heard you're a keen football fan. Yeah, um, when, when, when am I allowed to meet you one day? <laughs> Can't really hear you. Let me just move to a different part of the house. OK, OK. That's a lot easier. Well, I've heard so much about you, Mo. You're an amazing person that does so much for so many different people and everything that you have had to go through and are going through, but you care about so many other people. You care about being, I've heard, an ambassador now for the Acorn Children's Hospice, which is incredible. So the reason that I'm here today is to surprise you with the news that you have won a Pride of Britain award. Oh my gosh, you've won the Pride of Britain award. And this is the invite, so congratulations. Yeah. You're an amazing young man. Oh gosh, that's just amazing. I can't believe it. It's the best day of my whole life. And growing up and watching you, it's just been, just been amazing. I can't get my hair as good as you, but... <laughs> It looks better than mine at the moment. I was that lost for words that I saw his hair and then went on to hair topics. He was like right next to me here. I'm like, oh my gosh, it's crazy, isn't it?